You are working in the emergency department today. You suddenly heard an overhead page asking any available doctors to resuscitation room now. You quickly run over to the room. On the stretcher is an 80-year-old male. This gentleman has initially come in with a presenting complaint of back pain. As he was speaking to the triage nurse, he collapsed and was brought into the resuscitation room quickly. The nurses quickly put him on the cardiac monitor. His vital signs include tachycardia, hypotension, and it was difficult to read his O2 sat. He had a decreased level of consciousness and would only respond to verbal stimuli. Your attending physician asked for two large bar IVs and started giving two liters of normal saline. An EKG and a bedside ultrasound machine was called for. The 12 lead ECG shows sinus tachycardia only. On the bedside ultrasound, it demonstrates an abdominal aortic aneurysm that is 8 cm in diameter. You decided that the patient had a ruptured abdominal aortic aneurysm. You call the vascular surgery team STAT. As you're preparing the patient for the operating room, you continue your resuscitation by asking for two units of O-pause blood and typing and crossing the patient for another six units. In the meanwhile, the patient's blood pressure starts to improve after your resuscitation. The vascular team now arrives and takes the patient to the operating room.